Here we are, stage four of the 2021 Tour de France Fougere, and this could be the wrap up of two sprint stages in a row, which also closes out the Grand Depart in Brittany. It's gonna be a beautiful day for sprinters because cycling fans will remember the last time the Tour de France came here. It was stage seven of the 2015 Tour de France and Mark Cavendish then racing for Etix Quick Step, stormed to the finish line here, won the stage, and it was a huge celebration. But then, as in now, the winds are going to be a factor because we drove the course today and I got all excited because there's all these open stretches of country land rolling through this beautiful land of Brittany that could be exposed to wind if, if the wind starts to kick up and they say here the wind normally blows from the west and that means echelons everywhere, riders all across the road and it could be an exciting day also because the sprinters is a last chance for them ahead of the time trial the following day, stage five of this 2021 Tour de France. It's gonna be exciting. Just when you're out here, you feel all the tension and excitement building in, in Brittany and everybody around here loves cycling and you can sense that. So it's gonna be a party, a celebration. And in this Tour de France, there are a lot of sprint stages on offer. So you can really see guys like Caleb Ewan, Sam Bennett, those guys start to dominate and take control in the Tour de France. It's all gonna happen here in Fougere. A big sprint mix to the line. These are the sprint days for the sprinters. Obviously there are other guys, attackers, that could take advantage. So the sprint teams are really gonna put the pressure on out in the countryside. Coming into town, it's a series of long stretches. So we're gonna see chances for big teams like the Kuna quick step to blow things up in the crosswinds. We all know Peter Sagan loves to blow things up in the crosswinds. So they may do that to take advantage of those pure sprinters as we're getting closer into town here. But one thing's for certain, the tension will be building. And I can feel that already just two months out from the Tour de France, just driving these roads, getting all that flavor, all that excitement of the 2021 Tour de France that's coming into town.